In this video, we are going to learn about motion tracking with shortcut video editor. So I have the editor open on my screen and I will open a file. This file. And I will import it to the timeline. then i'll select the video here okay before moving on let me tell you what is motion tracking and why it is used motion tracking is a feature where the editor allows you to track to editor gives you a feature to track the movement of a moving object in a video so it is primarily used in cases where you need to track the constant movement of any object in a video clip. Maybe in a video about soccer like this one, you need to track some player then you will mark it with a motion tracker and attach some kind of marker with the object. This one or this one or this one. Suppose you want to mark this one then you will put some kind of mark over here. Then when the player moves the mark with the mark will move accordingly or maybe in you are making some satire video or comedy video and you want to replace the face of some person and as the person moves the face will also move such kind of videos. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. So I have selected the video here and then I'll click on filters then click on add filter then search for motion you get the motion tracker here click on it a rectangular area appears on the video so i will use this area to track any player here probably this one Okay, then give the motion tracker a name. Suppose this one and you can click on analyze. Now before clicking here, let me tell you that the algorithm that is written here, the name written here, you can choose any of these algorithms you want if one does not work or does not work properly then you can choose the another one so after i have selected the default one then i will click on analyze as you click on analyze you see here the analysis of the motion tracking is going on here this one was from a previous video i used so it is there but this one is analyzing the video currently so it will take some time and we will come back when the analysis completes okay so now the analysis is complete as you can see here and uh, after that we will just uh, go to the starting point of the video and click on play to see if the tracking is done or not yes the tracking is done here as you can see a green rectangle is covering the player and is moving along as the player moves so tracking is being done so what i will do i will use a simple text on top of the head of this player to show that how we are associating the motion the movement of the player with the text so you need not use the text a simple text you can use any marker or any clip art or any image you want so, so i will create a filter on the video add a filter and i will write text and use text simple where 
increase this gun yes now i will write something like uh, footballer and then just let me jump hit it it is better then just drag the lines like this then take it to the top of the player and then probably minimize it a little bit then take it here then maximize it again like this fine so i have a text filter here then i'll go to the middle then this is not required this is just for formatting purpose then i will need to click here load keyframes from motion tracker let me click here then the motion tracker name is footballer with that we created earlier and i will adjust the position i will choose relative position you can choose offset absolute position or size and position whatever you want i am using relative position then other things are okay then i will click on apply uh, this needs to be brightened up a little bit so i will add another filter called brightness brightness is here so i will just fine okay so go back to the text filter brightness fine so i will go back to the beginning of the video and then i will click on go play as you can see this text is moving along with the player means it is tracking the movement of the player and this green rectangle let me go back to the motion tracker then i will deselect this fine then go back to the beginning of the video then play it again now it is working you can see it this text is moving along with the player so this is how we do motion tracking with shortcut video editor if you have any queries then please post in the comments below thank you for watching we will meet again in the next video